Now, in warmer climates, tiger salamanders will breed generally throughout the year. Um, in captivity, sometimes you can stimulate their breeding by cooling them down for a couple months. Um, you can do this by just moving their enclosure into a cooler room, a room that stays around 60, 65 degrees. Don't feed them for a while. Um, let them shut down for a little while. Let them go into um, kind of an estivation state where they'll sleep for a little while and not be inactive. And then, you know, after a month or so, gradually bring up the temperatures. Um, this might stimulate the salamanders. Also, in their natural environment, uh, what stimulates them a lot is rain. Um, so some people will create a rain chamber um, using different pumps and misters to make sure it's constant flow of water. Um, or some breeders, what they do in warmer climates, uh, will actually create outdoor pens to breed these salamanders. Um, you need a, a fairly large body of water um, and some debris on the bottom, which helps the spermatophore uh, cling to, which the salamander, the male, will drop on a leaf. The female will follow behind them and pick up the spermatophore through her cloaca. And the spermatophore, of course, will go inside the female and fertilize her eggs. Then she'll attach her eggs when she lays them to some debris in the pond. Um, you can put sticks in there. Um, you know, any type of debris that, they, that she could attach her eggs to.